So we're going to show a um, structure that's kind of cartoonish, uh, something I drew about 30 days ago. And now we're going to show it as a regular image, as a, as a bump and reflection. And you can see it kind of uh, some of the detail in 3D mode. Now we're going to uh, show it as a, as a highlight or, a, or what you can consider it as an outline. And we're also going to show the highlights in uh, black. Now we're going to go to a uh, house we drew and we're going to place a background image. Here we're placing the background image and you'll see you'll see that we can select our, the reflection brush in the construction bar of the uh, 3D mode and we can Change, change the material so that it reflects the background as we're doing right now. Now we're going to turn off the background. And we're going to then zoom in on the house and we're going to uh, make the house walls transparent so we can see inside of them. As we zoom closer and closer to the house, you can see some of the detail. And now we zoomed a little too far, so let's zoom out. Hold on a second. Now let's uh, zoom back in on a room. And we're just lining the house, and now we're zooming in on the room. We can see the room with the reflections on the walls and, and also the shadow that we created. Uh, you can always generate a shadow in the 3D mode. And now we're going to change the type of uh, time. So we're going to make it nighttime, and we're going to make it a uh, nighttime with uh, moonlight. So you can kind of see differences in, in the shading.